Welcome to this short video tutorial titled Getting Started with Your Property Management Pages Website. First thing you want to do is to get your login from your welcome email. This email came to you right when you set up your property management pages website. Now if you ever have any problem logging into your site or have any customer service related issues, you're going to want to email helpdesk at propertymanagementpages.com. Again, that's helpdesk at propertymanagementpages.com. In this brief tutorial video, we're going to show you some very important things that you can do to immediately help drive some traffic to your property management pages website and hopefully generate some leads for you as well. The first thing you're going to want to do is log into the back end of your website. You're going to do that by going to your actual website itself and underneath the Contact Us tab, you're going to click on Log In. Now when you're on the login page, make sure you just enter your username and password that was in the welcome email there. After you log into your site, you're going to be taken to your dashboard. This is an important back end page on your website, and you're going to see this all the time right when you log in. Now of course, you're going to see on the left some of the different widgets and tools that you can use to, to customize your website. Um, first, you want to check out your post section. Your post is where you can actually go and write blog posts. And of course, these blog posts are going to show up underneath the My Blog or Our Blog section of your website here. Below that, you're going to want to click on Pages. And these are very important as well. These are all of the actual content pages of your property management pages website. Now remember, we've added many additional pages onto your site here that can easily be added to your main website. We're going to show you how to do that through all of our other customizable and training videos, which are all underneath the Agent Training and Resources tab at the very top. So you're going to want to click on here and make sure you view every single video that we have on here to learn how to customize your site, how to add content, how to add posts, how to make changes, and how to add blog posts to your blog section. You're also going to find over 250 pre-written blog posts related to property management or real estate investing right underneath this tab here, right on this page here. And again, this is underneath the pages section of your website. One of the other things that you're going to want to do right away is to post this Craigslist marketing ad here. This is a great ad to post anywhere where you can post it online. Um, we found that you can post this on Trulia.com, Craigslist.org, or Backpage.com, or you can also post this on uh, Active Rain if you have an Active Rain blog or many other real estate websites. Here's how you're going to post this. When you first get to the page, you're going to notice it's in this actual visual mode. This ad is very, very important to post because there's multiple links back to your website right in this ad, and this will really help your website on the search engines right away. First, let's go and post it to Backpage.com. You're going to see in the top right here of the ad where you can go from visual mode to text mode right here. You're going to want to click on the text mode, and this will take it and give you the actual HTML code for your property management pages website. Let's just make sure we highlight by dragging our cursor over all of this content here, right click it, and copy this content onto our clipboard. We copy this content. Next we're going to go to, say, backpage.com, and let's make sure we're in the right section in our local area. And the best place to post, of course, when you're in your local area, is under services under the real estate section. You could also try posting in the Homes for Sale section, but our experience is it really doesn't matter. The main purpose of posting this ad on Craigslist, Backpage, Trulia, and any other site is not for people to actually necessarily find it when they're looking around on that site. This ad is created because it does outstanding on the search engines, period. It's going to help also give you some extra links back to your website. So the first thing you're going to want to do is write a title. Now, whenever you're posting this on any site, make sure you use a keyword in the title. 
for example, this uh, ad will title Jacksonville Property Management Services. We're just going to right click and paste the content on to here. After that, it's usually a good idea to put some images in here if you choose to. You don't have to, but this will just help jazz the ad up a little bit. And remember, there are already images posted in this ad already. So we've got a couple generic property management related images there. Next thing we can do is select if we want to upgrade our ad. We encourage you to post it every 14 days and just pay $3 to do that 26 times. What that will do is that will make your, your ad virtually live for an entire year right there. So let's click continue. It's very simple after this. All we have to do is just enter the captcha once it comes up here and gets to the next page, and our ad is almost ready to post here. Let's just type in the CAPTCHA. And you can see below this how our ad will look. Very good looking property management related ad here. And let's just place the ad now. And it's good to go. Our ad is actually posted, and the ad will be immediately live there. And you can actually view the ad live there. Another thing you can do, another great place to post it on is Truia.com. Let's just write a new post. Now, when you post on Craigslist, you're going to do it virtually the exact same way you did the back page ad, where you're going to copy and paste the HTML code on there. Truia is a little different. You're going to actually go back to the visual mode on your blog post here. You see how you have the visual mode here? And we're going to actually go and copy and paste this on here. Um, on visual mode here. Let's just get this ad ready to go here. Okay, so we're going to actually go and highlight the entire ad here. This again is to post it on Trulia.com. Um, you can also use it to post like this on Active Rain or many other sites, but we're going to actually go and drag this over to Trulia, go right to the box and just drop it into the box right there. That's it. That's all we have to do. And then, of course, we need to title it. Um, let's do a different keyword in here. Let's do property management services in Jacksonville, Florida. That's good because that's also the actual title of the ad there, which you notice is a link right there. That's why these ads do really well in the search engines. There's a lot of different keywords relevant to property management in your local market already inserted into these ads. They do outstanding on the search engines because of that fact. So we just post whatever category it's in there, write in our city name, and we are about done here. All right, let's get through this. We'll publish it. And next, we're going to go over some other great ways that you can get traffic to your property management pages website right away. Um, next, you're going to want to get the word out about your property management pages website. Let's go back to the pages section, and you can, once you're on this page with all of your different pages, you're going to scroll down, way down here, to marketing welcome email. This marketing welcome email here is a great, great tool here. There's two different emails we've created for you um, that will really just welcome people to your site, tell them about your property management pages website, and um, help get the word out a little bit. It asks them to as well. So all you're going to have to do is just go and highlight all of this here and copy and paste it onto your email server. That's it. You can just go, right click, and copy this, and then paste it onto your Yahoo, your Outlook, Gmail, wherever you send emails from, and paste this in there and send it to everybody. Send it to all of your contacts, all of uh, your even other agents. This will really ask them for feedback about your site. So it really just gets the word out about your property management page's website. It mentions that you have a blog on there. It mentions that you have a cash-on-cash -cash calculator on there. Um, make sure you send these out right away to get the word out about your site immediately. Let's look at some other great ways to generate some traffic to your property management page's website immediately here. When you're on your site, the first thing that you're going to want to do on your actual site, let's just log out here to get the regular view of our website back again. 
go right back to our actual home page of our site here. Here we go. The first thing you're going to want to do, you notice how there's uh, social networking share buttons at the top and uh, uh, at the bottom of every single page on your website. One of the first things you can do to drive some extra traffic to your site is to get the word out about it. We strongly encourage you to do this, so make sure you share it on Facebook, on Twitter, on LinkedIn, anywhere and everywhere that you can find. On LinkedIn, if you're a member of multiple groups, we encourage you to share about it on these other groups here. Um, let's see. For example, you can post it to your updates on your actual page here. You can post it to any groups that you're in, especially local commerce groups, local business exchanges. These are great ways to get the word out and say, hey, check out my new property management website. There's lots of resources and information about purchasing investment real estate in whatever area you're in. That's one great, great way to get the word out about your site. You can also post it to Facebook as well. You can post it to your page right off of here or any other page that you choose to off of here. All you have to do is just click on them. Of course, I've already shared it on here myself but you can easily, easily share this. Another great thing, one last thing that you can do is to share this cash on cash calculator with people. Investors love this widget. They love this tool here, and they will come back to your site again and again. So one thing that you can do is just make sure you share it on Facebook and mention it and say, hey, check this cash on cash calculator to help determine a property's investment potential. I've added it to my website just for your benefit. And you're going to find when you stop to take about 10 to 15 minutes to do these few things I mentioned here, this is a great way to get started getting the word out about your site, getting some traffic to your website, encourage people also to view your blog and su to subscribe to your blog as well. Again, this is just the basics on getting started with your website. I want to strongly encourage you to view all of our videos about blogging and customizing your website and getting the most out of your property management pages website so you can become a property management lead generating machine. Remember, buyer leads are very easy to get for property management. We want to help you get more owners. We want to help you get more sellers and homeowners who want to use your services to list their properties for rent with you. We hope you found this video helpful, and again, please view our other tutorials.